हाउ टू फिक्स अपडेट के वी फाइव जीरो सिक्स टू सिक्स फोर नाइन फेल टू इंस्टॉल इन विंडोज टेन ट्वेंटी टू एच टू हेलो फ्रेंड्स के वी फाइव जीरो सिक्स टू सिक्स फोर नाइन इज द प्रिव्यू के मिलेटिव अपडेट फॉर विंडोज टेन ट्वेंटी टू एच टू फॉर जुलाई टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फाइव इफ यू आर फेसिंग एनी इशू इंस्टॉलिंग दिस अपडेट देन फॉलो द स्टेप्स इन द मेथड्स द फर्स्ट मेथड विल बी ट्राई इंस्टॉलिंग अपडेट फ्रॉम माइक्रोसॉफ्ट अपडेट कैटालॉग Go to the video description and click on the link to Microsoft Update Catalog. We will reach this page in your default browser. Here, three files are available: one for X64 based systems, one for uh, ARM64 based system, and one for X86 based systems. Check the system type to ensure which file is compatible for your system. For this, click on Start. Select Settings. Click on System. Scroll down. Select About. Here is the system type: 64-bit operating system, x64 based processor. Close the Settings app. This file is compatible with my system. Check yours. and click on the respective download button click on this link let the file download once completed click on the file preparing for installation do you want to install the following windows software update click on yes the packages will be copied to windows update cache then you will have to restart your computer follow the on screen instructions your computer will restart twice to complete the installation if this method doesn't work then follow the next method which is run windows update troubleshooter click on start select settings go to update and security click on troubleshoot click on the additional troubleshooters link then click on windows update Select run the troubleshooter. Follow the on screen instructions on the troubleshooter and then try to install the update. Click on check for updates from here. There you will find check for updates button. If the issue still persists then reset windows update components click on search type cmd right click on command prompt select run as administrator go to the video description you will find these commands there run these commands separately one command at one time copy the first line paste into the command prompt hit enter copy the second line paste into the command prompt hit enter copy the third line paste into the command prompt hit enter copy the fourth line of command paste enter next line
after running all the commands close the command prompt close other running programs and restart your computer then again check for updates and try to install it the next method is modify services click on search type services click on services find app readiness this one right click on the service select properties make sure that startup type is not automatic here if it is not automatic click on the drop down and select automatic make sure that service status is showing running here service status is a start so click on start click on apply click on ok right click on app readiness select restart then look for background intelligent transfer service right click on this service select properties change the startup type to automatic and click on start click on apply click on ok do the same with cryptographic services here it is right click on this service select properties the startup type is already automatic and the service is running so nothing is needed click on ok right click on cryptographic services select restart In the end, right click on Windows Update, select Properties, Startup Type must be automatic here and Service Status must be running. If it is not running, click on Start. A start would be highlighted. Here nothing is needed, click on OK. Right click on Windows Update, select Restart. Then check for updates and see if the issue is fixed if the problem still occurs you can uninstall third party antivirus program if installed for this right click on start button from the taskbar select apps and features find antivirus program in this list to be fair i have not installed any antivirus i am showing you an example here Suppose this is the antivirus, then click on this one and select uninstall. Again click on uninstall. If any uninstall wizard appears, follow the on screen instructions to complete the removal. Then again restart your computer and try to install the review cumulative update. If the issue is not fixed until now then run system file checker and dism tools click on search type cmd select run as administrator go to the video description you will find the sfc and dism commands there run both the commands one by one Copy the DISM restore health command, paste into the command prompt, hit enter. Then copy SFC scan now command, paste into the command prompt, hit enter. Once completed, type exit on the command prompt, press enter, close the other running tasks and restart your computer. Then try to install the update. 
if any of the methods doesn't work then you will have to clean install windows 10 launch a browser type windows 10 download press enter click on media creation tool scroll down for create windows 10 installation media click on download now click on the exe file for applicable notices and license terms click on accept Check the option create installation media, USB flash drive DVD or ISO file for another PC and click on next. Again click on next. Here check the option ISO file and select next. Choose a location and click on save. Let the process complete. Once completed, right click on the ISO file and select mount. Then right click on setup.exe and select open. Uncheck this option and select next. For applicable notes and license terms window, click on accept. In the end, click on install. Let the installation complete. Your computer will restart several times. During the installation, the preview cumulative update will be also installed. That's all friends. Thanks for watching the video.